Hi, I'm James Brundage with Start Automating, and today I'm going to introduce you to PowerShell Pipeworks. PowerShell Pipeworks is a framework for building sites, services, and applications in PowerShell. And today I'll walk you through four simple examples, how to build a simple page, an example of server-side PowerShell, a command service, and a module service. The simple page shows some of the basic commands that you have in Pipeworks to help make HTML creation easier, like new web page and write link. There are several more, and you can check out the writing pages with Pipeworks topic to find out more about it. There we go. A nice horizontal link list at the bottom. Write link with a bunch of items piped in becomes a list at the side. And new web page turns it into nicely balanced HTML if it can. Next, we'll go ahead and show some server-side PowerShell. What we'll do here is we'll use the convert from inline PowerShell command to take a mix of PowerShell and HTML syntax. Here's our HTML, and then here's the start of our PowerShell code, and by default, the output of this gets piped into a command called out HTML, which displays it as a table. And there we are, a quick verb table in just a few lines of PowerShell and HTML. Things get very interesting when you start to build command services. In most modern applications, you need to have both a site and a full REST web service, and PowerShell commands can easily be converted into REST web services with the convert to command service command. And this will show the colorizer from uh, PowerShell Pipeworks write script HTML turned into a web service. There we are, colorized script and a web service with nice easy URL parameters. And the final thing you can do in Pipeworks is create what's called a module service. And a module service contains several command services, uh, a bunch of module metadata, and it can also contain server-side pages that use common context. And this means that you can use dry development techniques or don't repeat yourself throughout your site. So this will recreate the Pipeworks site, which uses common analytics trackers, CSS themes, and uh, more common chunks throughout the pages. And you're welcome to explore the source code of Pipeworks when you download it. I'd advise you to check out Writing Pages with Pipeworks and Server-Side PowerShell next, and I hope this helps.